All right, so this is part three of our talk. Um, I'm putting them all together in one talk, but uh, basically what I've done is I've talked about here, this is the cycle, right? It's a perpetual cycle. This makes what we're doing so highly scalable, It's the it will become the most highly scalable launch platform. The cool thing is, is being an affiliate doesn't cost anything because ultimately we want to launch OpenCorps. Why? Because OpenCorps invests back into our system. It becomes a highly scalable thing. We create a new crowd funder, the Archangel. The Archangel, who are they? They are lesser stakeholders of open corporations that take up to 80% of net profits and invest them back into what? The open startup paradigm. So ultimately, these what we're trying to launch is innovations that are going to help and you know slow and to lessen the pain of the end of growth. Understand that is our big pain. That is what we're trying to solve. And as that paradigm becomes a reality, people are going to go, holy crap, Michael Trout had the vision back in 2012, and all he's missing is some silly capital to launch it. So ultimately, success equals valid idea. If your idea validates, guess what? We get to move on. So please, if you go to our hard, you know, take a survey, answer these questions. So what's the big picture? Where are we headed? What's this open corp? Well, the open corp ultimately is a selfless corporation. And to give you an example, right now, less than 1%, okay, of the individuals support. I mean, these companies all listed here are supported by the 1%, the 1% who have the money. What are we trying to do? Well, OSI, the open startup incubator, right? Um, OSI will replace the 1%. Remember, it removes those seed investors with the 99%. And as we launch our open corps, they're turning around and putting more money, okay, back into our system, which is what? Is launching more corporations. These individuals are the archangels, right? The archangels. And what we ultimately are creating is something I call the open corp cloud. It's a keretsu. It's a keretsu, which is a network of blue oceans that are working together in order to bring about change. So why is Bitcoin the currency that I want us to use? Well, ultimately, Bitcoin, um, when I did found up dollars, I did found up dollars because I didn't know Bitcoin existed at the time. And Bitcoin is exactly the currency that I would was I was seeing found up dollars becoming since Bitcoin exists it makes sense to actually just use uh, Bitcoin you know it's fixed there's only a certain amount of Bitcoin can't be created every Bitcoin mind is shared in the open incubator startup community so what that means is this is that basically if someone earns a Bitcoin right through our platform remember we're doing peer-to-peer -peer mining the entire community we're talking about millions of people who are basically mining Bitcoin are sharing bit micro Bitcoin Bitcoin can be divided up to eight decimal places right so everyone is getting Bitcoin based on the amount they're mining so if they're doing 10% of the mining they'll get 10% of the Bitcoin right being mined by the total community so if you've got a supercomputer so it's fair it's equitable we share in every action a like a follow a join a tweet um, you, you name it okay has a micro Bitcoin transaction that goes into a Bitcoin pool this Bitcoin pool is shared now with the winners OK, so depending on, you know, it, basically you're giving this micro amounts of Bitcoin, people are actually putting Bitcoin into these ideas. Those people that put the Bitcoin into those ideas are actually going to win part of that pool. Right. Because they're the active players. So you're actually feeding indirectly just by your interacting on it. And what do you do with Bitcoin? Well, you can spend this Bitcoin on pretty much everything. Um, you can buy cool computers, you can buy any product, you can buy cars, you can buy houses, you can buy whatever you want, okay? You can put whatever you want on our platform. Um, you'll also be able to change and outsource, okay? Output our, our product. Now, what I mean by is that we will take your Bitcoin and translate it into any currency you want um, at a small transaction fee. So, you know, what I, the, the soft proto is a new way to launch ideas without having to code, right? The soft proto concept is kind of, you know, think of a proof concept as the napkin drawing. I've, I've done this talk before, so I'm going to skip over this here. Um, a soft proto is the model. It's kind of like what the architects come in and say, hey, will you invest in this? This, you can you know, go to this and you can play around with the soft proto. This is the soft proto, the soft prototype. You don't, no coding needed. It's that simple. 